Hello boys and girls, I'm going to quickly discuss with you the first assessment for produce simple word documents and what's required within it. If you have your templates set up for your company, have your logo in the right hand corner, whatever it will be, then you want to set up each of these documents. So first, for example, we're going to have a letterhead, nice and simple, company name, address, date, whether it's handwritten, you can print it off or whether you're going to type it. Next example is of a site instruction, which would be done on site, form and recording an instruction to say a subcontractor or a consultant. Make sure you have all the formalities at the top. Purchase order, purchasing goods and services. Description, quantity, total price, don't forget your GST. Variation request for a variation within the contract on site. Make sure the big mistake from builders that they don't get them signed off. Make sure the owner or the principal signs that off. We have a meeting agenda form. Job number, date, attendees, type of action, items and so forth. You can change those tables to suit or something similar yourself. Tax invoice for making a claim. Quantity, description of work, total amount, tender form for tendering a job, that could be known as a quote. Time sheet, just record the hours on site. Site safety checklist to assist you on site it's for WHS issues. That's a formatted one that we've got from the WHS work cover. Management plan, EOT, extensions of time form for inclement weather or any delays that you want to put in a claim. And then finally, the site daily diary for the form to complete for activities on site. All right, I hope that helps. Thanks, guys.